way America views exercise. And today, Norma has gratiated us with the ability to interview her because she has an amazing success story. She just showed me some pictures. You have transformed your body in, how, how long has it been now? Like six months around there. Been about six months. Yes. Okay. And tell me, okay, let's, they haven't seen the pictures yet. They're going to be able to scroll down right underneath us and see these before and after pictures. You did this by yourself, and yes. this is phenomenal. So just tell America how you can tell them what to do so you get the exact results you just got. Well, let me tell you one thing. This is our temple. We have to take care of our body like your own self because nobody's going to do it for you. Amen. And uh, I'm a special mother that I have to take care of myself because nobody's going to take care of our kids like we are, you know, as a mother. So as an instant, you know, have a special son with Down syndrome, so I have to have the energy to take care of my own kid. I walk, I do kickboxing, shoe fighting, and Zumba, all type of exercise you can imagine. So, so it's you, more of a you, just, it's just, um, you have to confuse your, your, your mind and your body because if you get used to it, the same routine, you're gonna get boring. Exactly, so you didn't just choose to go do Zumba. You yeah. mixed it all up because yes. you saw that it's very easy to get up to a plateau. Yes. But you broke those plateaus by trying a bunch of different stuff. And mm -hmm. in the last six months, you have completely transformed your body. Again, those pictures are gonna be right underneath our video here. You did this, you have a Down syndrome, Down syndrome child, you were just explaining. And you did this because you have to ha live a long, healthy life so that you can take care of him. Yes. So you were saying that you had the, the, a lot of your friends were choosing liposuction. Yes, the easy way out. Okay, the easy way, it's, it's a brutal way. It, it might be easy in the beginning, but it ends up being a very brutal thing to do to your body. And right? it can be dangerous. Exactly. And so you chose maybe the hard way to start, but what you're going to end up with, the reward at the end is an extremely healthy body, healthy lifestyle, transformed lifestyle. So what do you, what do you eat typically now? How, how has your diet changed? Well, I typically eat normal, like everything. Don't eat red, red meat, you know. Um, I try to eat more healthy, a small partial, you know, like a small um, fish, uh, tuna sandwich, you know, but no white bread, okay. no soda. Okay, no red meat, no water. white bread, no soda. So yes. you got rid of the three of the main culprits right yes. there. Red meat. And you drink a bunch of water. Yes. Okay. And you made your portion sizes smaller. Yes. But you eat every three hours maximum. You know, you don't have, a, you don't have to struggle without going, without eating. You have to eat something because your stomach eat constantly because your stomach be eating yes. too much. Oh, so you cannot nice. leave your stomach empty. Right. You know, a lot of people get confused. So I'm gonna eat a small meal in the morning and then in it, late at night, that's wrong. They think starving themselves is the way to go and it's absolutely not the way to go. When yes. we eat small meals throughout the day, we keep our blood sugar levels stable and we can burn more fat. Now, did you did you research all this stuff on your own? Where did you learn all this? <laughs> Believe it or not, I I just start doing things on my own because I don't have time. I would just sit in a little here, a little there, but you know, always healthy stuff. What I do, I go in. Uh, you know, you don't have to go to the fancy restaurants or uh, a fancy uh, grocery store. You just have to get like healthy stuff. Change you have it the way you eat. You know, like fish, turkey, chicken, you know, no bread, wheat bread. Wheat bread. Yes. Yep. <laughs> yep. You know, and uh, no sugar, like juice out of my table, out of my kitchen. Nothing sweet. No sugars. You know, you Only can have like almond, almond, like uh, pistachios and stuff like that. Always handy. Like put it on the table. Because I thought you're in a hurry and you just drop something and you just don't get that much hungry at the same time. Now you have a very active job. You're a housekeeper, right? Yes. So you weren't sitting all day. No. You were moving around all day and yet it still took, which is a fantastic thing and a lot of people don't realize how healthy that is for you to have a job where you get to move all day. So that's wonderful. But even with the amount you moved all day, you still had to increase the intensity of your exercise. 
and you still had to, had to fix the diet yes. in order to get the changes that you did. Yes. And you did an amazing job, and America just look at Narma and go, I can do this! They can do it, right? Yes, yes. Okay. I was really big. And now, if you have one thing to tell them, we're going to ask you two things. One is going to be um, your favorite go-to recipe, like your favorite, just, I could almost eat this every day, healthy recipe. Mm -hmm. The other is, well, let's start with that one. Well, from, like in the morning breakfast? No, anytime. But your favorite, just, this is my, uh, you know, favorite meal to have, one of my favorite meals. Like chicken sandwich. Okay. You know, no mayonnaise. So no mayo, that's important. And you just get those big lettuce instead of bread. Okay, you can do a lettuce wrap instead of bread. Thank you. Yeah, yeah that one. Ooh, and I love lettuce wraps. <laughs> you can just add it like a, spa a spicy, you know, mm. just something spicy. You don't, you know, some people don't like to have anything plain. So I like to have, you know, like Spanish people who like the spice. That's right. Hot sauces, salsas. Yes. It's not that you can't have flavor, it's that you don't want to add in hidden fats like mayo where you rarely didn't even know it was there and it yes. was an extra hundred calories that yes. you didn't even notice. Yes. And like we love lettuce wraps. It's not it's not a punishment <laughs> for you us. Don't to, you, you don't you don't miss it. It's, it's, it's exactly. so good. I mean I, you can just get that in Carlos Jr., you know, it's mm -hmm. just like Carl's you know? Jr. You can make something at Carl's Jr. a healthy choice. Yes. That's a fast food restaurant here. we have here. This is Carl's Jr. is um, on the East Coast. It's Hardee's. So here we can we can order our our fast food sandwich with lettuce wrap instead of yes. with the bread. And it, it's those little things, right? It's yes. the little changes Make that life easy. Add up. Yes. Yeah. Awesome. Okay. And you're talking to America right there. Somebody pretend you're talking to the old Norma. Oh my God. Okay. This is Norma a year ago. Yes. How do you convince yourself back then to go for it? Oh my God, that's a tough one. Back in months ago, I was big. I don't have no energy, and uh, you know it's just too personal. But uh, I just make myself to, you know what, get up and do it, and start the new year. I that's what I take take the step and move forward and never look back because that's our problem we look back and when you start the new year it's a new beginning so you have to make the change because nobody's going to do it for you absolutely you have to believe on you that's right because you are priceless yes <laughs> yes it's no another norma that's right you there's know, not another norma so want. live it the best life you can norma yes. you rock all right, change the way of America. Change the way America views exercise. Norma did it. You can do it. That's right.